So, uh, so the reason I chose to do a landscape, um, especially for my donation here, I've already done landscapes and I've seen plenty of other landscapes from other painters. A mountain range that is um, in the village of Mesita, um, which is part of the Laguna Village, uh, where I was raised. And from looking, the, the really cool part about this is when looking in this exact direction, you're looking in the direction of Laguna. I, I, it worked out that looking out this bay window would be Laguna looking towards Santa Fe through a bay window, I guess, but in the opposite mirror effect in a way. And um, the landscape in Laguna is actually red mesas. It has a real deep, um, what is that, iron um, uh, material in the mountains. So that's what makes the mountains so red. And so I, I've used red mesas plenty of times in paintings, but for this particular one, it was so connected with pottery, with um, everything. So with, with the red mesas of mesita, red, red of pottery, uh, it just kind of made sense. It, everything came together after a while with um, what pottery design could be used as far as influence in landscape and everything. And, uh, I guess it was a just a cool way of actually making a cool landscape and um, yeah, using my research and summing it all together in one painting project. So that's that's the description for this painting. <laughs> Found a lot of influence from the pottery here. This is one pottery from the collection, and um, this is one that's actually in the sketchbook here that uh, I did study. I really tried to understand the design. This is all up to the artist, uh, like paintings and anything else. Um, the design work is all their own. So we, as far as people researching or trying to understand what the designs mean, um, can find certain influence. But as far as myself, I tried to find what I could understand with it. And being the artist sketching, I tried to understand what the artist was doing when they were applying the paint to the pottery. Um, this work, uh, this piece in particular, was one that I used in my painting that I donated to SAR. And part of the design work I used in the painting, the third painting from the left. And um, from what design work I've used and understood as far as Laguna pottery, um, it starts from the left side, and um, those pieces are actually old designs that I learned from Laguna Pottery around home, around my community, uh, different people's houses, every, everywhere that I'd be around, I'd, I'd try and understand what those designs meant. And um, from that, uh, I adapted them into my work. Uh, from the left side were what I already knew, the left des designs were designs that I used in my paintings already. And from the middle going to the right side, that shows my evolution as far as understanding uh, design tradition and moving it towards what I've researched. So this pa painting in a way is its own, I guess, metamorphosis or evolution, um, adaption on design work. And this piece here um, showed history as far as design work I knew and grew with me as the design work changed. I changed and I started understanding the pottery here and design work and adapting it into um, the whole um, um, influence of better design work, more strength um, and uh, a lot more intrigue and detail into the work. So that's what uh, I've gotten from these pots here and what I've tried to include with my sketches and influence and adding that into the project that I donated here to SAR.